What we have here is a wanton disregard for condiments and sauces. You feel me? This is a decent product, but for goodness sake, throw us a bone and give us some sweet chili sauce in a little packet next time. They even show a bowl of dipping sauce on the packaging. It might be nice to include the condiment, since it's generally understood we'll be pairing these apps with something sweet and tangy. Alright, I'll stop ranting for a bit and tell you what I like about them. They are crispy. We heated ours in the air fryer, and the wontons got all dark and crunchy around the edges. The middles are less crispy, since they're a bit sogified from the cream cheese filling. They're just a tad oily too, but letting them cool for a spell on a paper towel or napkin remedies most of that issue. They taste good, like a typical crab puff, but without the crab. The jalapenos are picante enough to give the wontons a kick, but not enough to produce any discomfort, at least for folks who enjoy moderately spicy foods. There's a decent amount of cream cheese in every bite, so there's a rich, milky aspect to them as well. They really do want to be dipped in something sweet though. Fortunately, we had some non-TJ's sweet Thai chili sauce stashed away in the back of the fridge. I think they're way better when slathered with that stuff. $4.99 for a dozen little wonton appetizers, not the best value in the store, but still worth a purchase if you're looking for something tasty, crispy, and easy to make. Four and a half stars from Sonia. Four stars from yours truly for Trader Joe's jalapeno and cream cheese crispy wontons. Bottom line, 8.5 out of 10. Really darn good. Thanks for watching. Please hit like and subscribe.